episode of Next Upgrade, we'll be reviewing the Rocketbook Reusable Notebook. It's a person-friendly way to go paperless at school and work. And it's supposed to help you get smarter. But is it actually good? Let's find out. Welcome to Next Upgrade, your ultimate guide to upgrading your home to a smart one. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Okay, I'm just gonna go right into it. The Rocketbook is one of those things that I wish I had back when I was in college. It's sustainable, but more than that, it also helps me be really organized with my notes and because, you know, I like to doodle and stuff. Akonamon, I'm pretty impressed with how simple and clever design works. Yeah, I mean, if you hold one in your hands, you'll notice that the paper is actually a different texture and for good reason. That's because as long as you're using the pilot friction pen, you can erase anything you write on this with a damp cloth. Because of that, this notebook will last you a year's worth of writing. Personally, I love it because it lets me take down handwritten notes and then lets me digitize it easily. So I know, I get it, digital world, we type and everything, but I find the traditional way of writing down on notebooks is easier and it helps you remember more. Yeah, you know what? Psychologists have actually found that handwriting notes activates more areas of your brain, which lets you remember things much better. When I was in college, I would doodle a lot. Yeah. yeah, and this is something that you can't do on a keyboard. Oh, definitely. Now that we can digitize things, we can just take a photo of that and I can have my doodle notes up in the cloud. And honestly, being able to write or draw your notes is super important. Whenever I'm in meetings with clients, I like sketching my ideas. Pero be, uh, just playing devil's advocate. How is this better than, let's say, a tablet that people might already have? Well, here's the thing. I don't think it's fair to compare it to a tablet because this is you know, a traditional notebook. But as a traditional notebook, it's really good because it keeps you focused aside from the fact that the writing experience is way, way better. Imagine having a tablet when you were in, in, in high school. I'd probably be really distracted playing games or watching videos, diba? doing a lecture or something. But yeah, yeah, but this one marries the traditional with the digital because it then gets you to write your notes and then upload it to the cloud anytime. When we tested out the Rocketbook, I really liked how easy it was to send my handwritten notes to the cloud. All I needed to do was to hold my phone over my notes and I got a copy, just like that, in my Google Drive in just a few seconds. Honestly, that would be pretty useful for sharing with your classmates or your team. Yeah, imagine just going through that and then your your friend goes like, Can I borrow your notebook? Mm -hmm. Give me your phone. I'll send it to you. Instant email. Deva? Cool, yeah. Deva. On a more serious note, mm -hmm. sharing these pages is super easy. Yeah. See this QR code right here? Mm -hmm. The app can detect those and send it to pre-saved destinations like Google Drive or email. And what's nice about this is that it gives you options on how you want to save your scans. So they can be in JPEGs, which are photos, or PDFs, or even animated GIFs. 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 Oh no! GIFs! I said GIFs. The app oh. can even transcribe your handwriting into text, which you can copy and paste into other documents. Anyway, we also tested this out. How good the Rocketbook is at understanding handwriting. And here's how it turned out. Yeah, we're sending it to the email and we also have it transcribed. So, oh no. It says page one for Rocket for Book mine. Core. Yeah. The quick brown off the Lasky dog pumps over. Okay, to be fair, I wrote really badly. <laughs> for for yours. me, tick quick brown fox umps over the lazy dog. Close enough. Subscribe to Next Upgrade if you see this. Sub if you see this. Hey, it even read my doodle. That's pretty cool because you that know you wrote it really differently. Yeah, yeah, it's not like your typical. It's like full block. That's really cool. Each page of the Rocket Book has a QR code that's seen by the app, and it can send it to pre-saved destinations like Google Drive or Gmail. Yeah, and over here you can see that you can actually change all of the destinations. The cool thing is, it also has icons that will let you remember what those are for. For example, like the apple, you can, maybe that's like a grocery list, a star probably like for work stuff. The cool thing, if you're working in an office setting or if you have co-workers, you can also send these documents straight into Trello or Slack. Super useful. Super. One thing I do want to highlight is how budget-friendly this is. For a notebook that's essentially forever, that you have to replace the pages once a year or so, it's about 2,500 pesos. Yeah, and it comes with its very own pilot friction pen that you can already use out of the package. Having just one notebook that you can back up to the cloud is kind of unreal. Let me just say, if something happens, like for example, may baha or whatever, tas masira yung mga notebooks mo, at least with this one, automatically your notes are already in the cloud. 
So, perfect timing. With a lot of students going back to school right now, this is something that I think every smart home should look into getting. Thanks for watching this episode. Are there other smart devices you think we should feature on this channel? Let us know in the comments down below. And we'll note those for future reviews. Do not forget to <laughs> follow us on TikTok for more fun content. Oh, and check out our website for even more goodies. Do not follow Bea's example with those corny jokes, please. But you did. Do but not. You did. Do not. <laughs> um, but see you next Sunday for another episode of Next Upgrade powered by PLDT Home. See, see you, neighbors! neighbors. I mean, come on, you still said it. Do you?